Welcome back to the WVM Beacon Santa Telethon. I'm Owen. I'm Emily. I'm Joey. And we have an auction for you today. Uh, I guess we'll jump right, right into it. This is our final auction. Make sure you guys are calling in and bidding ends at 11. So um, to jump right in, first uh, item is item number 403. Oh, wait, we have a, a quick announcement. So the toys, the actual toys auction closes at 10 a.m. The full auction closes at 11 a.m. You should call in early to make sure you get all your calls in and all your money. To make sure you get your auction items that you want. So uh, first item is item number 403. It's a super soft 12-inch gray and white plush bunny. It's donated by the Dulaney family. It has a value of $10, and the current top bid is $5. Uh, once you snuggle this incredible soft little guy, you won't want to give him away. So, uh, yeah, I, it, this looks like it's the type of material that is truly like that soft type. I really do like this this type of soft fluff. It's big. And before right. we go to the next item. our next item, we have a total update. So, can I get a drum roll from everyone here? Drum roll, please, elves. 26... Twenty-six thousand one hundred and seventy-one dollars. Nice yeah. job. Yes, but well, that is fantastic. Our goal is forty. So please, 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 if forty for fortieth years, forty hours, yeah. Please, please call in, donate, bid. I mean, it's for a good cause. You'll feel good. We'll feel good. They'll feel good. Just do it, man. Yeah. Please help us reach our goal of this telethon. And uh, next item is number 397, is a Justin and Dave's Awesome Would You Rather game, donated by the Delani family, has a value of $10 and a current top bid of $3. Have a blast playing, playing Justin and Dave's Awesome Would You Rather game. The card game full of deranged dilemmas and difficult choices is guaranteed to break the ice at any party. That's always a good way to break the ice. That's yeah. really true. Would You Rather, that's a classic game. Pretty popular nowadays too, right? They gotta do like all those would you rather challenges and whatever. Would you rather overbid on this or not? True. There's, there's only one th answer to there's that. There's only one answer. There's only one right answer, I should say. Overbid. Overbid. Let's go let's go for getting that up. Is that three? Let's try to get ten or more, please. Oh, come on, guys. Alright. Oh. Hang on. Okay. Item number three hundred and seventy two is a creative escapes coloring set donated by Santa. It has a value of twenty-five dollars and a current top bid of twenty. So we're almost at an overbid. So there. let's keep going. Coloring is coloring. Coloring is not just for kids anymore. It's fun and relaxing. This set includes twenty-five beautiful coloring pages, twenty-four fine line markers, and twelve colored pencils. So I know I would have loved this as a kid. I'm not too into coloring now, but coloring is for everyone. So who knows? Get it for someone in your life who loves coloring. Coloring is always great. Oh, yeah, definitely. And, you know, they said it's super relaxing, right, these days? Yeah. And creative ex escapes, I feel like I know that. I feel like um, a lot of people need or really enjoy coloring just to relieve stress and whatever. So the next item is number 228. His name is uh, Humphrey Bear. Humphrey Bear, made by Aurora. Donated by Callie and Fenn Gift Shop in Concord. I mean, look at little Humphrey over there. Uh, he has a value of $18. The current top bid is 15 Come on, look at him. You're going to do that extra $3. Look at him. Look at him dance on the screen. He's waving. Meet your new bear friend. This is Humphrey. He is super soft and lovable. He sits about 10 inches high and is made by Aurora Company. Great gift for anyone on your list, unless you can't part with him. That is understandable. I can't part with him. So he's going to be here, and we're going to not. No, I'm just kidding. All right, so let's just try to get that space value or an overbid. Remember, if we get an overbid, we get to do one of the challenges here out of the jar. So if you want to see some funny stuff, donate a lot of money. All right. So um, item 308 is a Rubik's Cube donated by the Danine family. It has a value of $5, and the current top bid is $5. This classic toy never goes out of style. challenges your family and friends to finish this 3x3 three three cube and create new memories for the future. Yeah, it's a classic toy. It's been around for a few decades now. Yeah. Yes. Uh, was it big in the 80s, was it? Yeah. Has anyone yeah. here ever completed a Rubik's Cube? I know I haven't. <gasps> you did? Yeah, don't worry. So uh, I got it a while ago, and I looked up how to complete it on the internet, and then I did uh, complete it. It's not but fair. But I, do, I, I don't remember how to do it, but I do remember how to do one side of it. 
and make a T on each other's side. So, yay. There we go. Yay. Fun. All right. Item number 218 is a Raggedy Ann doll donated by the Manning family. It has a value of $12 and a current top bid of $3. This adorable Raggedy Ann doll is 29 inches long, squishy, and floppy. Make a great toy for any little person on your gift list. She has classic button eyes, a white apron, and is ready for fun. She's ready to play. All right. I never had a Raggedy Ann doll. I know Raggedy Ann dolls are super big, and they were super big. Yeah. And look at her. She's gorgeous. I love her. Look at her little socks. Raggedy so Ann's cute. Nice. That's a classic, right? Yeah. Raggedy Ann. Mm-hmm. I wonder why they ever thought it would I mean, Raggedy Ann. This is very flattering, but whatever. Yeah. So, um... One seventy six. So this is item number one hundred seventy six. It's a oh, 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 Star Wars: The Force Awakens electronic lightsaber donated by Jen Adams. Okay, has a value of twenty dollars. Has a current top bid of eight dollars. May the force be with you. Star Wars: The Force Awakens electronic lightsaber lets you have fun saving the galaxy with Ray's blue lightsaber. It's the blue one. Now, I'm not saying the Sith are better, but red is better. But yes, I still will probably bid on this, and I'll try to get it up to that $20 face value, as should the rest of you. And let's reach for an overbid on this one, too. We're getting there. So last night after our auction, we had a little downtime, and a decent amount of hosts were calling in, calling in and bidding on stuff that they wanted. So you might be having a bidding battle with one of our hosts here, but you should definitely duke it out and see who wins, because it's all for a good cause. Yeah, exactly. All right, but next item is number 401, is a super soft brown and white bunny donated by the Jelani family. It has a value of $10 and a current top bid of $5. Come on, you guys were $5 off. This adorable guy is incredibly soft. Anyone would be lucky to cuddle up with him. So true. Look at him, yeah. The big I know, he's so great. And he's so soft. Too. Aww. Like, once more, I can tell just by looking at it, it's like that really soft material like um a lot of like the, i have a blanket in my house that's like this it's like i, I don't even know it's so soft yeah. uh, a side note a light bulb fell on it and then it uh it got like melted but on your <laughs> on your blanket on my blanket yeah. well this bunny friend that's is totally hell, yeah. cool so he's gonna be fine take good care yeah of take good care of our bunny friends in real life and for stuffed animals all right Item number 398 is a We Love Movies trivia box donated by the Delaney family. It has a value of $10 and a current top bid of 25 oh, Yes! Oh, over bid. I'm getting the job. Alright, it's over here, <laughs> so sit down. Who's picking? Jada, you want to pick? Alright, fine. Jada, pick. Right. Um, Alright. So. Write a quick jingle about the current item. Ooh. We so love we love movies. We love movies any time of day. We love movies. We love movies. Overbid for the Delaney family. Family. Yeah. <laughs> Woo. Thank you. Yes, thank you. The rapper takes over. Mhm. Fantastic little thing. All right. What? Okay. Well. Whatever. You go. One. Yes. 323. Item 323 is a Nerf N-Strike Elite Disruptor 2-Pack donated by the Maynard Eagles. It has a value of $25 and a current top bid of $17. First, no, fire and strike fast with the N- Nerf N-Strike Elite Disruptor Blasters. This quick draw blaster has a rotating drum that holds up the six elite darts. Choose your target and fire one dart at a time, or unleash all six darts in rapid succession. With this two-pack, you'll have one for you and one for a friend. Yeah, there's always something good about getting uh, two two like of the same gift, then you get to keep one, mm-hmm. right? Oh, yeah. Or you could just give two to your loved ones. No, yeah, nerf fights are always fun. One and one, you cannot. You can have a nerf fight with them. You know what I'm saying? Just like the nerf fight that we had that I won. No, I don't remember that. Uh, so the next item is item number 105. It's an adorable elf squishmallow. Ooh, they call it a squishmallow. Look at him. 
is donated by Santa, has a value of ten dollars and a current top bid of five dollars. We're just five dollars away from reaching face value, and uh, six dollars away from reaching an overbid and a challenge. Uh, meet Elliot. He's Santa's helper in the Elf Squad. He enjoys eating the cookies that Nick leaves behind on San on Christmas Day. Shh, don't tell Santa. I'm gonna assume Nick is not talking about Nick Kringle. They're instead talking about Nick, another character. No, it's obviously like Saint Nick. No, I. No, because it says the cookies that Nick, like Saint Nick, leaves behind on Christmas Day, and it says, Shh, "Don't tell Santa." No, I think Nick left the the cookies out. He ate them, and Santa didn't find them. It's probably a guy named. Uh, guy named. Whatever. Nick, you know. well, it's Nick Riley. We can all agree that it's Nick Riley. That's right. It's Nick Riley. Don't tell Nick. Shh. Don't tell Nick. Uh, so the next item is number three sixty-five. If my what? Okay. Okay. Why? Three sixty-five. Oh, it's not. Is it not in here or something? Well, um, it should be. It would appear that our okay. Oh, item three hundred sixty-five oh. is a. Oh, yeah, there you go. Item number three hundred sixty-five is a stomp rocket donated by the Cormier family. It has a value of twenty dollars and a current top bid of nine. Run, jump, stomp, send rockets flying up to four hundred feet. The set includes six rockets, wow, and a stomp launcher. Fun, fast, and easy with no batteries required. Oh, yeah, I know these things with the air, and you go, and then yeah. it goes, you know what I'm mean? saying? Yeah. They're super cool. How many rockets? Six? Because I know I'm about to possibly lose at least five, so I have one just in case. That'll be fun. All right. Uh, the next item is item number 136. Is a grab bag assortment of six die cast collectible cars donated by Santa and has a value of 60, no, $36 as a current top bid of $7. This is a grab bag assortment of six collectible die cast cars are all in original packaging and range in value from 15 to $2. Yes, so as aforementioned by Emmeline in a previous auction, die-cast cars are collectibles, so you never know how much each one is going to be worth. And you have six chances to, like, get a super cool, fun one. I mean, they're all super cool and fun, but you have six chances to get one that's worth, like, $40. So, totally, this bid needs to be way higher. This definitely needs to be an overbid. Yeah, let's try, let's reach that goal, at least get face value, and if we can, let's get that overbid on these. Test your luck. Uh, next up is item number 399. It's a Hatchimals Fabula Forest, donated by the Dulaney family. has a value of $50 and a current top bid of 25 So Hatchimals Fabula Forest, who will you hatch? This season four Hatchimal comes with two Hatchimals collectibles. That's collectibles. Uh -huh. You can teach your Hatchimal to walk, talk, dance, and more. Oh, these are the things you crack open from the egg and then it, like you like teach it how to like do stuff. Shoot, I, that's actually kind of cool. Why didn't they ever have these cool toys? Oh, those toys seem to be hot these days. Yeah, they are pretty hot these days, actually. Yeah, weird. They were super hot last year, and they're still super hot this year. Yes. All right, and uh, uh, next up. Item number 412. Is it this is, the dog that sings? Yep, is a singing fluff puppy donated by the Delani family and has a value of $13 and a current top bit of $5. Come on, you guys, we got to get higher. This puppy is adorable. It's fluffy. Yeah, it and sings a song and spins around. If not for this holiday season, hey, Valentine's Day is only 70 days away. This is sure to brighten up anyone's day. Can we listen to it? Can you activate it? Yeah, well, hang on a second. Let me give it a mic. All right, I'm coming. We're going to figure out what song it plays. Wow, that was fantastic. So Some now that we know what this head. dog is capable of, we definitely should have at least a face value bid on this guy. Come on, you're super so, cool. Someone's got to love it. If not you, then you got to know somebody, right? Yes, all right. It's fine. Item number 153. 
Item number 153 is a Classic Games 100 Games. Donated by Jen Adams. Has a value of $18 and a current top bid of 15 That's three away, four away from an overbid. Let's try to reach that goal. Bring game night to a whole new level with this classic game super pack. Includes all your favorite games and many more to discover. 10 board games, 36 dice games, and 54 matchstick games. This is like one of those things where it's like um, you open up and there's like a backgammon board, a chess board, a blank board, a board board, a board if you're bored, a board if you are a board. You know board. what I'm saying? Yes. What are matchstick games? People were really bored back in the 1920s and 30s, so they only had matches to play with, so they made a bunch of games with matches. That sounds fake, but okay. I made that all that up. I have no idea what that it actually it sounds kind of true. It might be. Who knows? All right, so item number 185. It is a pack of five race or chase cars donated by the Lolly family as a value of $40 and a current top bid of $28. Toddlers will love to play with these, with this five pack cars of soft and and squeezable body, safe for young kids, walls and furniture. There is a tractor, a dump truck, a cement mixer, a bulldozer, and a garbage truck. Each car is flexible with no sharp corners or edges for your child's safety. Pull back, wind up, and let go. A pull back toys are the best. Those are so fun. It's like a remote control car, but you don't have to do anything. Yeah, toy cars are best. All right, Best item number 127 is a Road Ripper's garbage truck donated by the Lally family. It has a value of four dollars or five dollars and a current top bid of four dollars. So we're just one short, guys. I mean, look at this. Look at this guy. Red motorized garbage truck has electronic lights, sounds, and movable parts. Any child three years and above would love this fun toy. As aforementioned, three years and above does mean and above. So I want this. You should get it for me. Okay. You're not gonna get. You're not gonna get it for me. One extra dollar. Just kidding. Cause you know, if I'm gonna bid, I'm gonna overbid. Okay. Cause I want to see these weird hosts do some funky stuff live on TV. Yes. And I know everyone at home wants us to too. So make sure you call in early. And speaking of all this stuff, these are all toys. Toys are closing at 10 a.m. It is nine. Call in now if you want to get your toys. By the time the auction closes, One we have hour. four minutes. To nine. We have an hour and four minutes to closing, so make sure you guys do that ASAP. Uh, next up. So our current item looks pretty cool, but can I see the tag? That'd be great. Awesome. Seventy-three is the is the tag of this one, and it is going to be the Lego Creator Mighty Dinosaur Building Set. I don't even know if I need to look at the description of this one because I've been eyeing this one in the Lego magazine for a long time. It's donated by Santa. Has a value of fifteen dollars. Here we go. It has a current top bid of, give me a drum roll, $20. Yes. yes. All right. Overbid, overbid, overbid. Let me do it. Let me do it. Let me do it. Let's go. Do it. Do it. After this overbid, we're going to get some fresh faces in here so you can see some of our hosts. Thank a tech crew member. Let's, let's just say thank you on three. Ready? One, two, three. Thank, thank you. you, tech crew. Yes. <laughs> if the techies didn't hear oh, yeah. my really long speech earlier, you can go back and watch it because it was a really long speech. But I love you all. Yes, we do love you all, but uh, Talal is definitely number one. In that. Talal doing Talal's uh, job, man. No one else can do it. Yeah, Talal out here, you know, breaking stuff. Yeah. That's uh, <laughs> okay, so uh, I am not. Uh, we're still on that Lego thing, real quick. So it's a dinosaur, and it can rebuild into into like a couple more dinosaurs. I think it's four in one or three in one. Three in one. Three in one. Dinosaurs are awesome. Legos are awesomer. Lego dinosaurs are awesomest. Most awesome. All right. Item number 380 is a Twilight Turtle, donated by the Delaney family. It has a value of $40 and a current top bid of 30 This Twilight Turtle projects a magical starry night sky for better sleep. It features a starry night sky protection, oh, projection, sorry, with eight constellations in three different colors. It will automatically shut off after 45 minutes. The package includes a storybook, adoption certificate, and a star guide. So this is one of those things where you get it for your kid and, like, it really helps them, like, chill out before bedtime because you can turn it on and they can look up at the stars and it's just, like... And it turns off, too, after yeah, 45 it turns minutes. off. Yep. It's like my, mom, my mom always makes me put my radio on sleep or whatever because I put it on to sleep and then she has to come in and turn it off. And I tell you, this one, they won't have to turn off because it just turns off automatically after 45 minutes. 
So um, our next item is number 301, which is a Wilson basketball. I know Wilson is a quality brand. Donated by the Maynard Eagles. Has a value of $20 and a current top bid of $15. We are five away from reaching face value and six away from... An overbid. There we go. The official basketball of the NCAA Championships and NCAA March Madness raises the standards for performance and innovation on the court with Final Four tested grippability and playability. Our technology is designed for every second of play from buzzer beaters. Play like it's March all year round. Yes. Yeah. I don't know what NCAA stands for, but it's probably for yeah. basketball. Yes. So we're going to remind you that the toys close at 10 a.m. and the auction closes at 11 a.m. And I think we're going to like try to do this as smooth as possible. But we're going to head out, and we're going to hit you up with some host seniors, because we are all juniors. So you want to come in? I see Emmeline. Molly? Want to come do it? I know. Charlie, you're here too? Sick. Okay. So come on in. Here you go. There's only two mics. All right. Can I steal your seat? Thank you. Uh, you want this? Yeah. Do we have the little iPad? Oh, do you have a password to that one? There we go. All right. We do not have a password for this one. All right. So good morning. We are the senior hosts. Um, we're happy to be here. Um, we're feeling a little tired, maybe. Um, but we're going to continue with the toy auction. How fun. Um, so kick it off, Charlie. Well, we've got um, item 305 up here. Oh, 305. I have that. It's a Captain America flying UFO ball. Whoa! Donated by an anonymous donor. Has a value of $10 and has a current dot bid of $12. We are starting with an overbid. Does that mean an, an overbid? I think bum, it does. Bum, bum. Your little superhero will have high-flying fun with this Marvel Avengers Captain America UFO ball helicopter f floats. It floats above any surface. Easy to control with the palm of your hand. 40-minute charge time for flight time, 6 to 8 minutes. Molly, do you know what your overbid challenge is? No, Emmeline, what is it? Do 18 jumping jacks. Do 18, 18 jump jumping, jumping jacks. Jumping jacks. Yes. This is what I get for skipping the workout. Yeah, it actually is. <laughs> No, I I know the password. She meant to the auction thing. Oh, that's from Molly. It's fine. You can use your your phone. It's just it's just it's the same thing. I just got metrics. How many? Eighteen for twenty eighteen. Eighteen. Very nice. Yes. Yes. And there's one over there too. <laughs> we auctioning off two. Uh, starting at uh, 33 cents, we've got two iPhones, slightly used. Oh, 20 cents. Ooh. Does anyone have this Ooh. next item up and ready to rumble? 295, yeah. <laughs> We've got item 295 here. It is a braided slingshot craft kit donated by Santa. has a value of $15 and a current top bid of only $5. Spark your child's creative side with this braided slingshot craft kit. The kit includes all the supplies to braid your own slingshot to fire off soft foam balls. That sounds like a fun time. I would enjoy that. That would be a good gift a for any time. sort of anyone, but especially like younger teenage boys, I think, or younger boys. Yeah, probably. Be very fun. All right, so this... N I bet Jasper would like it. Yeah, I bet he would. He'd like a lot of these toys. That's my little brother. So item 122 is a Destiny Mega Block Set donated by the Kroll family. And has a value of $120 with a current top bid of 60 Guys. Unbelievable. We guys. are underbidding. That's so under. So Low with this, you can create and control your very own mission with a Destiny Mega bun Block Bundle. <laughs> um, collect and combine with other Mega Blocks Destiny sets and build your legend. 
So it's one of those fun things where you can buy more kits and combine and add to what you already have. Very fun to last through the years. So definitely a good Christmas gift to get around this time. So Indeed. bid. Bid and enjoy. All right. The next one I'm very excited about. Item number 102 is an adorable Ooh. penguin stuffed animal donated by an anonymous donor. Has a value of $10 and a current top bid of $5. It is so soft. This adorable squishy penguin was sent by Santa to be a friend. This is Puff. His name is Puff, guys. A tech fanatic penguin. He's the internet's number one fan and is always searching for the newest thing. He's also into robotics and has the most fun when he's building or coding. Squishmallows are soft and cuddly to hang with. I need to go touch him real quick. Just because his name is Puff and, like, that's crazy. All right, get me over here with this okay. amazing elf. Oh, hello, friend. He was sent by Santa to be a friend, actually. That's what it said. Guys, this is not five dollars. This is fifty minimum. All right, let's <laughs> let's get it. Let's get it rocking and rolling on Puff. All right. Such a great pillow. All right. Raise your hand if you want Puff on this couch. Like All of our hands are. Your, up. All of our hands are up. <laughs> there we go. Yep. Yes. <laughs> are all of these? part of the toy auction. Yes, they are, actually. So I need to get my bids in. All of these friends. Don't, don't overbid me, Charlie. I'm going to overbid you, Emmeline. No! Actually, I'm going for the bigger ones, not the... Okay. Not 435. Can you tell everybody which one I'm going for? <laughs> Just one. Hey, everyone, you should bid on number 435. So I have to raise my personal bid. Raise more money. Yay, charity. Um... Oh yeah, item 302 is a Paw Patrol light and sound lookout tower. It's donated by the Maynard Eagles, has a value of $20 and a current top bid of $10. Paw Patrol is on a roll. The mighty pups are ready for action. Their tower rotates to reveal pups like Sky, Chase, and Marshall. They even talk. It includes a 15-minute nightlight, too. No job is too big, no pup is too small. It's a good motto. All right, so up next we have item 234, a puzzle truck donated by Joy Street Gift Shop of Concord. It has a value of $21 and a current top bid of $8. What is it? It's a puzzle truck made by Luke's Toy Factory. This sturdy toy is for ages 3+, plus, precision, precision engineered from 30% reclaimed wood fiber. This is a fun to play. This is fun to play with because it comes apart and can be put back together again. And it things in the top loader and deliver a bunch of smiles. So I was actually talking about this yesterday. Me and Emily were talking about how popular and fun and how often we're now seeing reclaimed wood as like a new kind of trendy thing. Um, but the puzzle truck is really cool and works for a bunch of ages as well. Probably on the younger side, but very fun. Up now we've got item number 190. It's a tan stuffed, I call it kind of grayish actually, stuffed giving bear, donated by Fritz and Gigi, the children's shop, has a value of $30, and has a current top bid of $15. Super soft teddy bear, it is so soft. Yeah, we filmed with him, or her, in the intro video, and let me just say, I got to hold and squeeze it, and I love, it's, it's almost as good as Puff, I do have to say. He's got this tag on him as well that lets friends know that whether they feel big or small, brave or worried, he is there to give them comfort with a warm hug. The Giving Bear was generously donated by Fritz and Gigi, the children's clothing shop in Concord, and this store specializes in clothing, toys, and accessories from ages zero to tween. I think sometimes we all just need a warm hug, so that works. Item 374 is a Leapster, ooh, vintage, Princess and the Frog learning game. Donated by the Delaney family, has a value of $20 and a current top bid of $2, guys. Join Princess Tiana and all of her friends in this exciting learning game from Leapster. Kids will use math and literacy skills to help Tiana pursue her dreams. This game works with the Leapster and Leapster 2 and is recommended for ages 4 to 7. Now that was a good movie. I do have to say Princess I and the Frog. I love the Princess and the Frog. Very good movie. 
All right, so before we move on to our next item, we're just going to let you know that the toy auction closes at 10 a.m. So in exactly an hour, or a little less than an hour, um, the toys will close. So all bidding will end for the toys. The full auction is going to close at 11 a.m. So make sure to call early, click on bargains or steals and deals, and uh, WAVM will call all top bidders when they... Uh, receive their when they when they are the top bidder we will call yeah so act fast yeah. definitely bid now get on it call in for these items check out our website all that fun stuff exactly Up next item 168 is a puglet pug puppy toy donated by Callie and Fen gift shop in Concord it has a value of eight dollars and a current top bid of eight dollars let's get an overbid it won't be that hard I know um it's adorable and so soft this little Puglet, puppy, pug, stuffed animal. You can take him anywhere, and he will not eat your slippers. <laughs> Aww. <sighs> very cute. It was a very nice shop in there. Um, Lucas and I got to pick up exactly. the items, and people are so nice, and they've got fantastic things as well. So the next item, number 378, is an Angry Birds Go memory game. Donated by the Delaney family has a value of ten dollars and has a current top bid of three dollars. Wow, these are getting really low, guys. A fantastic memory game for Angry Birds Go fans, ages three and up. Flip the cards to find matching pairs of these Angry Birds before they zoom away. Well, Angry Birds is, it was and still is iconic for a small percentage of this generation, and memory games are quite fantastic in the learning department they really are I, that's the only thing i can actually do let's also acknowledge that there's only less than three hours left of the telethon or around about three hours left of the telethon so let's update tiktok the snowman snowman see what he's doing up over there so like less than or like three hours because the closing is going to be then yeah uh, TikTok. Oh, also, I don't think we've updated the um the smokestack back oh, there. Yes. What, did we just get a total or something? This is the most recent total. Oh, good. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, I, I I was because we hadn't gotten one since yesterday. So, oh yeah, let's update the smoke. Oh, that's good. Okay, so twenty six. So that's um. Right. Yeah, let's just keep it right there. Um, if, if, yeah, if you want to pan so you can see that. All right, so Charlie, so, just in case anyone's tuning in now and missed this ahead of time, will you give like a, or Lucas, will you give I'll, a I'll give a little un, um, understanding. So this right here is our little Santa's workshop. And the elves in here are, are working busy, but they're going to work even faster and harder if people donate. So the more you donate, the faster they work, and the more the smoke rises in the Santa's workshop. So, um, so each <laughs> no Molly, <laughs> <laughs> each line is ten thousand dollars, and um, it looks like uh, the elves have worked hard enough to reach twenty six thousand. So Charlie, there it is. It's like a little, right there. And wow. we would really, really, really love if suddenly there was smoke coming out the top. So yeah. Keep the bits we, coming. We, we want the smoke to stay, not not to stay in the... In the tube. We want uh, it to explode. Well, yeah. <laughs> so... We want it to uh, pull some uh, Diet diet Coke and Mentos. Yes. So for those of you that saw our science segment earlier, you know what we're talking about. Yeah. All right. So item 381 is a Fisher-Price Soothe and Glow Seahorse. It is donated by the Delaney family and has a value of $15.00. And a current top bid of six dollars. This cuddly, soothe, and glow seahorse is perfect for little ones. It plays up to five minutes of music, different lullabies, and ocean sounds. Babies can activate it with just a little gentle squeeze. So that's an awesome thing to have for like little kids in cribs and help them fall asleep and have like some background noise kind of thing. So definitely check that out. Oh, we have a Ooh. big item coming up. What's this guy? It's item 432. Whoa. <laughs> Die Hard Ford F-150 Raptor Remote Control Vehicle. 
donated by Jane Healy in memory of John Healy, has a value of $65 and a current top bid of $30. Whoa. Live out your four-wheeling dreams with this diehard Ford F-150 Raptor remote-controlled vehicle with USB charger. Jane Healy donated this truck in memory of John Healy, who thoroughly enjoyed cars and trucks, as do I. It looks like a fantastic toy there. Item number 112 is an extreme machine, SRT Viper. Donated by the Lally family. Has a value of $65 and a current top bid of $40. Check out the stunning extreme machines, SRT Viper. Tri-band radio control car. Pew, pew, pew. Huh. This RC is great. It's beautifully designed. 1 to 10 scale replica, which is fully functional with clear channel technology. It's also specially equipped with a tri-band control. So with this, you can race and fully control up to three RC cars at the same time, increasing your chances of winning any race. No complicated assembly required. Uh, 1.2 V5V battery pack is included, so you don't even need to get batteries. Okay. That's incredible. That is awesome. Our next item is number item 286 is an unlock mystery adventure. Donated by the St. John family has a value of 50 and has a current top at fi of 5. This Tonopil's treasure. Captain Smith hid his treasure on Tonopil Island. Unravel the mystery before Johnson and other treasure hunters beat you to it. This new adventure to unlock invites you to join a search for buried pirate treasure by using your logic and deductive deductive <laughs> detective skills to progress through the adventure. Tonopil's treasure sets you at start for a hunt of the treasure Captain Smith, hidden somewhere on Tonopil Island. As your adventure begins, you have been arrested by the governor and thrown into prison, and you'll need to escape quickly, especially since the Johnson and famous treasure hunter is also on his way to the Tonopil in search of the very treasure you seek. Unlock is <laughs> Unlock is a series of escape adventures for you and six players. With one hour on the clock, players work together on a deck of 60 cards as a team, searching for clues, combining objects, and solving puzzles. The free Unlock companion app runs, and the timer will also provide clues, offering hints, and confronting success. Once the team has reached a solution and entered a correct code into the app, they will escape and win the game. Oh, it's like a, um online escape room. That's kind of cool. Oh, wow. <clears throat> yep. I'll do it. <laughs> Alright, so now we're going to switch to gift cards. Oh, you can, like, hand it back. Yeah, and we're going to hand it around. Alright, so, uh, gift certificate number 175 is a Hudson Art and Framing $50 gift certificate. You know, that's really cool. So you can get some custom, um, framing and framing is really expensive i know um so if you have any pieces of artwork or photos that you would really like to have framed it's yeah. a great thing to have as an like something to have around yeah just to, like hang up no yeah. and that... purchasing it sometimes people like put off framing things exactly it'll kind of like remind you to do it yeah like i have so many photos that i'd love to like have framed and hanging on my wall but like i don't so yeah me too all right um <laughs> Gift card 177 is a gift certificate for hair by Taylor Jane. Yep. It's, I, I assume it's a full gift certificate for a haircut. Yeah, so go get your hair done before... Oh, it has a value of $50. The holiday season comes. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Yeah. Get your hair cut. Um... All right, so uh, the next gift card is gift card 180. Uh, Thendera's hair design, 56, uh, 50, it has a value of $56, and it's a gift card for hair design. That uh, is pretty cool. Mm-hmm. All right. You know, I need to get my hair done. I've yeah. talked about it a lot. Oh, yeah, you, you, <laughs> you were going to get your hair done, but then you didn't because yeah, of the telephone. Yeah, I was going to get my hair done before the telephone, but I just did not have a time. <laughs> so maybe, maybe I'm purchasing one of these gift cards. Yeah. Um, Alrighty. So uh, does, do you want to read yeah, this one? Yeah, sure, I'll read some. Okay. 
Does it matter which order I go in? Um, I... Yeah. All right. Um, so. Just go the next one. Um, item 183 is Tip Tech um, Nail Studio Certificate for a manicure. It yeah. has a value of seventeen dollars, which is awesome. Um, does anyone know what town this is in? Is this um, in Sudbury? Lucas? Tip Tech. Oh. It's kind of ringing a Ooh, bell. That is ringing a bell. Uh, Me and Lucas visited a lot of nail salons, actually. I believe that's in Sudbury. Mm-hmm. I'm thinking so, too. I apologize if I'm incorrect. No worries. But, you know, Tip Tech Nail Salon, they were really, really nice to us. Yeah, and it's so I like to get people manicure gift cards for Christmas and stuff, especially, like, my friends. Um, but if you donate now, then you're getting a manicure for a friend, but you're also donating to a charity. So you're kind of like two birds with one stone. And we have a confirmation that it is from Sud- in Sudbury. Yes. Okay. <laughs> um, so item mm, item one ninety four is a gift certificate for fifty dollars to New City Micro Creamery. Oh, that is a steal. That is a steal. You know, I love my ice cream. Oh, and same. I have to say, every ice cream place that I go to is amazing. So and that, New City is yes, so cute. They're so cute. They're really, really nice there. Okay. Our uh, the next item we're gonna do is four fifty three. It's a what is it? All right, I'm just giving it a look. It is a city sampler certificate. Oh, okay. Ooh, oh, okay. For a three night stay at a hotel of your choice, it has a value of five hundred dollars. Does anybody know the top bid on it right now? Last time I checked, which was like an hour ago, it was like four hundred. How do you check these, these guys? They're on the. Yeah, it's on the. Oh, they're on the iPads. Oh, <laughs> I'm dumb. <laughs> I haven't done gift certificates yet. <laughs> uh, four fifty-three. Let's see. No, so that's definitely a real. Ooh, it's it's catching up there. That sounds really cool. Yeah, it is really cool. I'd love to do that. Um, it's one of those like, kind of all-inclusive. Trips, it's really awesome. Yeah, and really affordable. It's much harder to find stuff exactly like that. Um, so next gift certificate is item, or is number one ninety five. It is a twenty five dollar gift certificate to Helen's Restaurant in Concord. I am a huge fan of Helen's. I have some friends that work there. I like some of their sandwiches. Good stuff. What? Oh, so. As fun as it was to use these gift certificates, or to go over these gift certificates, we want to go back to the toy auction. Oh, yeah. So we're bringing it back. Woo! Item number 261 is a beginner's art set by Royal Langnickel. I think I got that right. Donated by an anonymous donor and has a value set, I mean a value of $25. Has a current top bid of $20. Wow. Maybe if you bid $6, we can get an overbid. Woo! It's a really nice basic set of art supplies that comes in handy wooden carrying case. There are three charcoal pencils, six graphite pencils, twelve colored pencils, eraser, sharpener, blenders, a sketching pad, a ruler, and it even comes with a posable mannequin. Whoa. Wow. For $26? That's right, overbid, 26 Um, Very portable. No, it's not, but it should be. It's $25. But it should be 26 I agree. Very portable. This has all the essentials to get creative anywhere. Bid now. Please bid, do. Bid, bid, bid. Wow, well, getting musical. All right, what do we have next? We got 393 Which is a Black & Decker six-speed hand mixer. Donated by the French family, has a value of thirty dollars and a current top bid of forty dollars. Was that? Was that an overbid? That was an overbid. <laughs> it sure was. Alright. Uh okay, it's speed time. <laughs> um well we're gonna quickly do this overbid and then we're gonna get into the next items. Okay. Um, grab a tech or audience member to help with the next item. Kara. Uh, come up. <laughs> oh, what's the password to this? 
Kara, uh, you're gonna read the about the next item. Come here. Welcome. <laughs> uh, all right, all right. So it is item number one hundred four. Uh, we're gonna give it to you. Item 104 is a Fine Arts Theater Place VIP basket donated by Fine Arts Theater Place. Has a value of $100 and a current top bid of $125. Whoa, Nelly. Ooh. This Wait, hang on. That's another overbid. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, well, I think we don't have time for overbids. Yeah, we don't have time for overbids. So, uh, okay. Item 124 is a Cars gift basket donated by the McCormick family. Has a value of 40 and has a current top bid of 25. Beautiful basket. I, I kind of want it and I love cars. <laughs> okay. Very next nice. Item. All right, the next item is item 155. It is a blue and black wool felt clutch donated by Jackie Rogers. Once again, for those of you that don't know, Jackie Rogers owns Global Goods, the company here in Maynard. And so it has a value of $20 and a current top bid of $5. Let's get that up. All right. Item. item number 217 is Harry Potter Complete 8 Film DVD Set. Donated by an anonymous donor. Has a value of $40 and a current top bid of $30. That's eight films, guys. You gotta get with it. All right, next item. Speed round. Nicely. Speed round. We're gonna speed round. Kinder. Oh. Item number 392 is... Yeah, we all got the cardinal, so someone needs to change. Um, 392 is a Kinder Joy set of 12 eggs donated by the Delaney family. Has a value of $20 and a current top bid of $12. Keep bidding on that one. Item number 327. Item 327 is a cardinal painting donated by Santa Claus himself and has a value of $100 with a top bid of 10 Somebody bid on this bird. Okay. Item number 324 is a bird painting More donated birds. by Santa. Has a value of 100 and has a top bid of 5. Come on, guys. Can't you see that? It's quality art right there. Beautiful frame. All right, next one. Thank you. Item 319 is the Bob the Black Cap Chickadee painting donated by Santa. Has a value of 150 and a current top bid of only $5. So someone, please, bid a little more on that one. All right. Our next item is uh, item number 316. It's a Randy the Redhead painting donated by Santa himself. Has a value of $150 and a current top bid of of a current top bid of $30. Speed round. Speed round. <laughs> you told us quick. We're going quick. <laughs> Medium speed round. Slower speed round. How about that? Uh, all right. <laughs> <laughs> Item number 179 uh, is a beach ball clock donated by Santa. has a value of $10 and a current top bid of $11 overbid. Do we have time to do overbids? No. Nope. No? Nope? All right. It's always time for the beach, you know? Got to keep it going. 480 is a green candle floral centerpiece donated by Haas Florist and Maynard. It is priceless. And only has a current top bid of twenty dollars, so I think we should really get some more bids up in there. It's beautiful, beautiful. Yes. <clears throat> Item four seventy nine is a teddy bear floral arrangement, donated by Haas Florist and Maynard. Has a value of so fifty dollars and has a current top bid of ten. And please notice, I know we're going fast, but medium slow round, medium fast round. Um, medium there is slow. <laughs> there's a beautiful vase on that flower arrangement. Boss. <laughs> uh, item number 312 is a Debbie, uh, Debbie the Duck painting. It's donated by Santa, has a value of $100, but only a current top bid of $5. Come on, you can go up by that. I want Debbie the Duck in my room. This beautiful... Oh, wait, we're not doing that. <laughs> item 220 is an eco-friendly cargo truck puzzle. Donated by Joy Street Life and Home, a fantastic place over fantastic in Concord, place. We love West her. Concord. Has a value of $21 and a current top bid of $8. Go check them out. Go bid on this eco-friendly cargo truck puzzle. Recyclable. Recyclable. Item number 148 is a Lego DC Superhero Girls Lena Luther Kryptonite Factory. I think it's supposed to say Kryptonite. Um... 
Donated by the Concord Toy Shop has a value of fifty dollars and a current top bid of forty dollars. Wow, um, we love that. Legos are very educational. Charlie really likes Legos, so yeah. All right, item 477 is a snowman floral arrangement donated by Hawes Flowers of Maynard and has a value of $40 with a top bid of $6. Wow, that is a beautiful... I don't know if <coughs> the camera's... Yeah, the camera's doing it justice, but look at the snowman vase. Look at it, uh, and look at the flowers. That, come on, that's adorable. I want that. Bid, bid, bid. <laughs> item 460 is a potted poinsettia. 26 inches tall, donated by the Flower Pot. Has a value of 30, has a current top bid of 35. That's an overbid. Um, wow. We did an overbid for this one yesterday. So, earlier oh, yesterday. okay. So we're good. We'll let it slide, but it's Are we it's not in supposed to be doing overbids? Item time we get an overbid, I will try to balance this on my head. Oh. We're doing medium speed. Item now. 290. Is Sounds a Disney dangerous. Princess Royal dress up trunk donated by Santa has a value of thirty dollars and has a current top bid of eighteen dollars. Guys, I am obsessed with this. <laughs> Alright? I had something just like this, and let me tell you, it changed my life. Alright? This is good stuff. Bid on this. Any little kid would love this. Just saying. Yeah, I sure would. <laughs> I would. Our next item is item number 232. It's a National Geographic Shark Tooth Dig Kit. It's donated by Santa, has a value of $20, and a current top bid of $17. Ooh, National Geographic Shark. I like it. I like <laughs> it. Is that, is that 224 up there? Uh, looks like it. Item 224 is a woodland Santa decoration donated by the Egan family. Has a value of $20 and a current top bid of $35. That's a nice overbid right there. So item 481 is a swan floral arrangement donated by Haas Flowers of Maynard. Has a value of $40 with a top bid of 35 So let's get that up there to the full value. Just five more dollars. Do Call in. The special thing about this is it has a beautiful glass swan vase. All right. Thank you, Ivan. Thank you. Woo! Item 475. Mary, you don't have a, you don't have a mic. Don't eat. <laughs> Oh, no. <laughs> Item 475 is a Bird's Paradise Floral Arrangement. Donated by Haas. Florist has a value of 50 and has a current bid of 25. That is gorgeous. That is gorgeous. It's leaving me speechless. So and silvery. Um, item number 258 is an outdoor adventure kit. Donated by Santa... Um, value of thirty dollars and has a current top bid of twenty three dollars. Wow, that looks fun. It does. Who doesn't want that? Like, who wouldn't want an outdoor adventure? Like, um, I've saying. seen that before, um, somewhere. But I do know it comes with a handy um backpack that you can put everything in, and it's really cool. Yeah. Item number one seventy is a dog treat gift box. Donated by Santa, has a value of $25, and a current top bid of $35. There's another great overbid there. Thank you very much. Thank you. Okay. Item 239. No, 89. Sorry, 289. 289 is a binge-watching beauty basket with caramels and hot cocoa. Ooh. Donated by Joy Street Life and Home. Nice. Has a value of $55. And has a current top bid of fifteen. I think we can get that out. Catch Emline bidding on that in like two I seconds. I am leaving the room to go bid, guys. Read that number to me again, Meredith. Two eight nine. Two, I eight, will nine. say it again. Right two eight nine. Just call the number. Here I go. Oh, there she goes. Two eight nine. So there two, eight, she nine. is making her bids. I left a few minutes ago to go make mine. Three ninety one. Up next, item number three ninety one. After whatever it is. Ivan's putting out there. Oh, 128. You got that one? Um, yeah, I got it. Item 128 is a grab bag assortment of 10 
I mean, seven die cast collectible cars. I don't know where I got ten. Donated by Santa has a value of forty dollars and has a current top bid of ten dollars. I know where I got ten. Yeah, seven dollars. I know where I got ten though. It should be ten dollars. Actually, it should be forty dollars. But I'm gonna be nice and say it should be ten dollars. Did I not say seven at first? Breaking. Okay. Announcement. Toy auction closes in 30 minutes. 30 minutes at 10 a.m. Uh, Regular auction closes at 11. Call early. Click on bargains and steals and donate. WAVM will call all top bidders. <laughs> Woo! Call in. Perfect. I'm literally about to call in myself. Um, okay, I, after Emline's done, I might call in myself. Emline's calling in right now. <laughs> you know, love that. We gotta get these, get these items. All right. Item number three ninety one is a multicolored leopard print scarf donated by the Delaney family. Has a value of fifteen dollars and a current top bid of only three dollars. I think that should go up a little bit. So you should bet bid on that one. Um, that's fantastic. Up next, one seventy one. Not me. One seventy one. Item 171 is a Crave brand box of handmade chocolates donated by Crave Candies and Gifts of Hudson. Has a value of $29 and a current top bid of $20. You know, who doesn't like chocolate? Who wouldn't want this? Yeah, you're right. Who who wouldn't? I would love it. Who doesn't know someone who likes chocolate? Oh, I like this next item. You know me. We know Charlie. Um, can we... With an iPad. What is it? I can't see number thank you all right so it's item number 210 it's a thing of uh, uh, basket of squishies donated by sugar snap has a value of $35 and a current top bid of $15 you know this is full of squishies you know like there's like stress balls and like, you can squish them and oh. Meredith you should bid on that uh, th 210 <laughs> Up next, we have item 473. It is a floral arrangement donated once again by Haw's Flowers. It has evergreens, red carnations, and a festive accent with a red sleigh. How fun and festive is that? It has a value of $50 and a current top bid of 27 27 oddly yeah. specific. <laughs> <laughs> it sounds like a little bit of a bidding war may have happened there. Somebody yeah, said 25 Somebody said... You do $2. Uh, uh, bidding more. If it's like neck and neck, you're like yeah. $2. Oh, both of you, paparazzi. Um, I did actually do the $2 rule when I was just bidding against somebody else. I'm about to do the $2 rule myself. <laughs> <laughs> but if you have the, ab uh, the like the ability to do the $20 rule, <laughs> that's the way to go. All right. So, what's this item? This item is number 437. It's a Baby Alive Cook and Care Set. Donated by the Delaney family, has a value of thirty dollars and a current top bid of ten dollars. I had a baby alive when I was young. I had a baby when I was young. <laughs> no, I had a baby alive doll, and they're amazing. They eat and they poop. So yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Item number 321 is an electronic guitar combo set donated by Santa has a value of $20 and a current top bid of only $5. Come on, people. This thing is crazy. It's got mics. It's got the guitar. It's got everything. It's it's insane. That's It's like your full set. I don't know what I'm saying. Item number 375. Oh, so did Molly. Uh, Item number three, s <laughs> three seventy-five is a Pop One Thousand Piece Heroes Puzzle donated by the Delaney family. Value of ten dollars. Current top bid of five dollars. Looks like a very cool puzzle. Nice, good stuff. All right, who's next? Item number 134 is a kitten toy variety basket with 20 cat toys donated by Santa. Has a value of $10 and a current top bid of $15 over overbid. Thank you so know, much for overbidding. I know for one, my big boy would love these. He likes to play on his own. So if you have kind of a lazy cat, they would love the things that are in that basket, okay? Who doesn't have a lazy cat? 
<laughs> I used to have a very athletic cat. Item number uh, 189 is a Boston Bruins mini goal set donated by the McPhail family. Has a value of $35 and a current top bid of $11. Wow. Look at that. All right. I think we're going to just move right on to our next toy. So item number 278 is a musical band drum set. Um, it is donated by Santa Claus himself and has a value of $20 and a current top bid of 10 Let's get that up there. It includes a bunch of other toys like maracas, whistles, tr- um, tambourine, and so on. So that's an awesome gift to get like little kids to have play dates with, you know, stuff like that. So, yeah. Item number 145 is a miniature glass Christmas tree with ornaments. Donated by Santa Claus himself. It has a value of $20 and it has a current top bid of $15. I think we can get that up a tiny bit. Yeah. All right, what's next, Charles? Item number 350 is next. 350 is a Christmas wall hanging donated by Santa. has a value of $20, but no current bid. I think this is the first one in a long time that has no bid at all. That's strange. Look at that. Ivan, I think it's held vertically. Wait. wait. And turn it around. Yep, just like that. Oh, okay, so it, like, holds pictures and stuff? Can you show that again? Yes. Love that. Ta-da. Yeah, so that's what it actually looks like. Beautiful. <laughs> okay. Uh, next is uh, item number 408. It is a pink, purple, and blue knitted jellyfish donated by the Delaney family. has a value of $15 and only a top bid of $4. Oof. That's wild. I think that could really be a lot higher. These little jellyfish are so adorable, too. I feel like any school teacher, any parent would just love to have something adorable like this hanging. Miss Miss Cairns. Miss Cairns. Yeah. Oh, there's so many. Item number 341 is a pastel colored rainbow grid blanket. Donated by uh, Santa Claus himself. It has a a value of priceless. It's priceless. It has a current top bid of $8. $8. You know what else is worth $8? Not that. (laughs) (laughs) <laughs> no, no you, they need a It's worth more than that Sorry <laughs> Oh, this is me? Um, item number 355 Is a knitted baby's blanket In pastel colors Donated by Santa Is valued as priceless And has a current top bid of $5 It's hand crocheted Very, very beautiful Very, very pastel For any baby Item number. I have no idea because I can't see it. Three. Eighty-six. Yeah, three eighty-six. Cool. Three eighty-six is a Family Feud game box. It's donated by the Delaney family. Top uh, value of ten and a top bid of ten as well. Wow, it's really cool. Right on the money. (laughs) Oh, nice. All right, so that looks like a fun thing to have for game nights. Oh, up next. Let me see that, Ivan. Is, is the Mahjong game donated by Lucas's family. That's right. Let me tell you a little bit more about it. Um, so it is a Mahjong set in a world map case. It's very pretty from the outside. It was donated by the Lou family and has a value of $80 with a current top bid of $30. This game is awesome. It's super easy to play, or you can learn to play it. They have the directions inside. Um, some of you may recognize it from the new movie that's out, Crazy Rich Asians. No. That, that plays a very important part in yes, the story. Yes, it does. About strategy, but it's a great game for all ages. Yeah. Up next. Three Number 304 is a Just Believe holiday mug donated by the Deneen family. It's valued as priceless. has a current top bid of $5 for teas, coffees, Christmas spirit. You could put whatever you want in that thing. Next item. All right. Next item is n- item number 240. It's a ro- remote control car for toddlers donated by an anonymous donor. It's valued as priceless and has a current top bid of $15. Ooh. Remote control. Tr- looks really nice. <laughs> yeah. I'd like to get that for Charlie. 
Yeah, I would <laughs> I would take it. <laughs> um, item number 160 is a digital photo frame with a 1 gigabyte SD one card. 1 gigabyte, wow. Printed that's by nice. an, uh, Santa, has a value of $65 and a top bid of $35. So you can have hundreds of pictures in one frame. Whoa. See, that's so wow. useful because if you don't like how like one picture looks, yep. it can just My change. Own. Or if you really have too many pictures to pick just one to put in a frame. You are correct. All right, what's our next Up item? Next, we have item 132. It is a penguin-themed hostess gift bag donated by the McCormick family, and it is valued at $60 with a top bid of $30, just half the value. Let's boost that up a little bit. It is super adorable and has... Um, eight-inch snowman, cutting boards, five-inch penguin dishes, and ch cheese spreaders. Penguin. Super adorable things for like the holiday and like little parties and stuff like that. So, holiday cheer. Am holiday I? cheer is in a bag right there. Item number three eighty-nine is a Hatchimals collectibles. <laughs> Get it? But um, purple <laughs> collector's <laughs> case with twenty-six Hatchimals donated by the Delaney family has a value of forty dollars and a current top bid of twenty-six dollars. Hatchimals. I think that they're all the rage. All right. Fifteen minutes. I'm not sure. Okay. Fifteen. Like all the rage. All right. Item minutes. 379. Total 379 total is a Paw Patrol Don't Drop the Chase game donated by the Delaney family. Has a value of eight and a current top bid of five. If you have a preschooler in your house, you are familiar with Paw Patrol. Players take turns knocking on the ice box, but be careful. The one that drops... Chase, the one that drops Chase loses the game. I love Paw Patrol. And just so you know, um, this is a toy. All toys. Uh, the toy auction is going to close in 15 minutes. 15 minutes, guys. Uh, Go bid, bid now. Right now. Thank you so much for bidding. Yay. All right. Our next item is... Um, item number 164. It is a dusty hand-stitched soccer ball from Afghanistan. Donated by Jackie Rogers from Global Goods and has a value of forty dollars and a current top bid of only twenty two dollars. Again, Wait. it looks like a bidding war going on there. That's so cool. That is a because it's, it's, it's not a, like ball. a traditional like. How much was it? It's value of forty. It has a current top bid of twenty two. All right. Uh, item number two seventy eight is that drum music set. Th um, with recorder, cassettes, tambourine, maracas, and whistle. Donated by Santa. Value of $20. Has a current top bid of $10. Let's make some music, guys. Ba -dum, bum, bum, bum. Bid on that item and we can make some music together. Da, 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 da. Item number 373 is a truck-themed gift bag of toys. Donated by Marie St. Germain. Has a value of $72 and a current top bid of $35. I would like to point out that... Um, it's got um, the paperback Mike Mulligan and Steam Shovel, a book that I read all the time when I was a kid. It's oh fantastic. Goodness. And um, it's got Low Loader, Dump Truck, Truck Puzzle, Goodnight Construction Site, Hardcover Book. It's got everything you need. All right. What's this? Item number 411 is a Thomas the Train, Thomas Saves the Day book and Stuffed Train, which I believe makes noise. Yep, there it is. It's like a, should I go over there and witness that? I think I should. Parents, hold, hold my boy. Yes. Just so you know what you're getting yourselves into, it's wonderful. Careful. Yep. All right, next item. What is the next item? Our next item is item number... 245 is the LOL doll. These LOL dolls are all the age, all the rage right now. It's as a value of ten dollars and a current top bid of thirteen dollars. Overbid. Oh, we just passed. Uh, we we just passed a thousand bids for the auction. Thank you so much, everyone. That is awesome. Oh my goodness. So yeah, bid on that LOL doll, and then we can get even more. Oh, well. Yay. Thank together. you guys so much for for bidding and. Um, I mean, it's not over yet, so we can let heck. Let's make uh, two thousand bids. What do you think? Do you think we can get there? We can do it. Persevere. Persevere. I don't know if that's the right word, but I said it anyway. Awesome. All right. Our next item available. Uh, it's not this one. Forty-four. I got. 
Item 44 is a floral arrangement in a cream and gold vase. Haas Florist Maynard has a value of 45 and has a current top bid of 20. This pretty arrangement is filled with evergreens, red carnations, silver pine cones, and gold ribbons. It sits in an elegant cream vase with gold accents. Beautiful. Truly beautiful. I think I'm going to bid on it right now. I um, have to give a thank you to someone. Flowers are nice. Item number 432 is a die-hard Ford F-150 Raptor remote control vehicle donated by Jane Healy in memory of John Healy. has a value of $65 and a current top bid of $35. So keep bidding on this one. This looks fantastic. Ooh, let's do the teddy bears over here once more. Um, so we've got... Can we pan over just yeah. to show you? Well, we've got... got Item number 450 and item number 361 are both giant teddy bears, 53-inch plush, soft, like super, super soft. Um, so we like that out. See how big they are compared to me. Excuse me. We've got an overbid on 361 of 45 dollars. The value is 40 dollars, and then on 450, we have it's. Um, it's put in here that the value is $30, but I know that that's the same thing, so it should be $40 as well. And it's got a current top bid of $40. And what is the... Um, please don't bid on these, because I want them. 435 Charlie. <laughs> Charlie, 435 He's kidding. Please bid on them. <laughs> Wait, do you have a microphone? Yes. They couldn't hear what I said, I don't remember he, I said he's kidding. Please bid. He wants them, but please Yeah, I do bid. want them. You just forced me to bid again. So item number 435 is this one. It's 36 inches tall, hug fun, huggable teddy bear. Donated by Santa, has a value of $38 and a current top bid of $12. So this is my favorite. So call in. It's very soft. It's perfect size, very snuggly. Very snuggly. <laughs> so I highly suggest you get in on this one. <laughs> What's going on, Lucas, down there? No, it's down there. <laughs> How's the giraffe, Mayor? So soft. So soft. There's also a tiger. There's t we have a lot of bears here. So um, feel free to check out our website to see all the bears in their certain sizes. But we have these two huge ones. There's another big one similar to the size of Molly's, which is number 361. And then there's kind of a cool vintage-looking bear um, over here as well. I love the giraffe with my whole heart. And we're going to look. Item number 112. I don't have a mic. Right. Item number 112, <laughs> an Extreme Machine SRT Lally. Viper, donated by the Lally family. Has a value of $65 and a current top bid of $40. Yes, <laughs> we love that. <laughs> Just silence for a second. Um, item number 415 is a Barbie's Bed to Breakfast set. Donated by the Delaney family. Has a value of $25 and has a current top bid of $25. Great. That's awesome. But I think we can go higher. Um, <laughs> Lucas also informed me that Bar Barbie Barbie has a YouTube that she vlogs on. And she does. So if you want to buy that and watch uh, her vlogs, feel free. Yeah, do that. Uh, Guys. Our helpful elf, can you s show me that tag one more time? Thank you. Okay. <clears throat> Item 168 is a Puglet Pug Puppy Toy. Donated by Callie and Fenn Gift Shop in Concord. Has a value of 8 and has a current top bid of 8. One more dollar and that's an overbid. One more dollar. We got this. We got this, guys. We got this. I love this giraffe. Oh, my God. All right. Item I would like to bid on is 435. Our host is currently bid bidding online. <laughs> All right, so on, our next item is item number 384. 384 is a um a baby Einstein plush octopus donated by the Delaney family has a value of $25 and a current top bid of $10. Ooh, it makes noise. Ooh. But we don't have time. You know, I might have to call in again because people have bid above my bids All right. in this short time that I've been. The toy auction closes in less than 10 minutes, guys. Less than seven minutes. Less than seven minutes. Probably. Yeah. <laughs> bid now, Meredith. All right, bid item, bid. item number 187. 187 is a uh, lavender bath and body soap. 
It's a uh, little basket of gift. It's a gift basket, and it come and it's donated by <laughs> and, uh, um, Santa. Has a value of thirteen dollars, and a current top rate of thirteen dollars. It comes with little soaps and a little thing, and it's really cute, perfect for traveling. Yeah, I'd I'd use that to Fantastic. bring to the telephone or something. You know what I mean? All right. The next item we have is item three hundred. I got you. No, give me a sec. Item three hundred. Oh, I, I, I got it. I got it. You got it. I got it. Item 300 is not a matching item. Oh, got it. <laughs> item 300 is a dog package donated by Scrub a Dog. Has a value of 50 and has a current top bid of. What the heck? <laughs> 35. This includes a gift card, correct? There's a gift card in this, right? Gift card for Scrub a Dog. I think they answered yes. I think it's on its ear. Yeah, it looks like it's on its ear. $50 gift certificate to Scrub a Dog. Located right on Main Street. Yeah. Oh, Stomp Rocket. Our number 365 is a Stomp Rocket donated by the, um, my thing isn't working. Oh, donated by the, oh, no. Mm -hmm. It's donated by the Cormier family. It has a value of $20 and a current top rate of $15. Wow. I loved Stomp Rockets as a kid. I really did. Me too. We I did them all, all over our house. Oh, yeah. They they were they just weren't as cool like they went up like a foot <laughs> that one goes up three hundred feet apparently so item three ninety nine is a Hatchimals Fabula Forest donated by the Delaney family has a value of fifty dollars and a top bid of thirty five dollars so let's get on this these Hatchimal Hatch and Animal what are they called Hatchimals are very popular right now and a great gift for anybody. And I really want someone to yes. bid on this so I can know what they are. Yeah, um, it's quite I the brand. I have no idea what, of... what, what exactly they do. I've been seeing little Hatchimals, big Hatchimals, hatching animals. Yeah. Okay. Looks like we have five minutes left of the toy auction. Okay. Woo! Oh, Lucas, good, good boy. You saw that before you even opened his mouth. I'm proud of you. Up next. Wait, yes. question. Earlier, I said, oh, those are nice flowers. I want to bid on them. Does anyone remember what number it was? Because I forgot. Again. Was it the swan vase? Or was it the sleigh? Or the penguin? Santa. All right. I do not remember. Or anyone that was kind of pretty. Anyway, I'll move on. I'll look for it. Oh, you can go look in the room. All right. Item number 337 is a knitted scarf. Um... It is a oh no it's a colorful hand knit blanket actually sorry <laughs> beautiful <laughs> um, it's donated by Santa it's probably just priceless it has a current top bid of ten dollars I think we can bid more than that if it if it can be used as multiple things I, I love the love those stripes Gavin love them stripes all right, All what do we right. Got next? So oh, the tag fell off. Item 425 is a gift bag collection donated by the Delaney family. Has a value of $15 and a current top bid of $15. Woo! Yes, so this is just a bunch you. of gift Keep bags bidding. um and like birthday bags and whatnot. Um, but they're bright colors and all sizes and it's great for this holiday season because I assume everyone is doing a lot of wrapping. Item number 429 is a Christmas gift bag set donated by the Delaney family, a value of $15 and a current top bid of $3. I think you could get that a little higher. This is very useful, again, as Emmeline said, during this holiday season. Wow. All right, what's next? Hi. All right, Jason, you got a... Uh, I think it's 161. 161. Item number 161 is a clutch purse or iPad cover. Donated by Jackie Rogers. Has a value of $16 and a current top bid of $5. That looks pretty cool. You can store a lot of things in there. Looks pretty awesome. Three um, minutes left. So this bear is already in a bidding war, so I see people are definitely on these phones right now. Um, <laughs> but it's gone up to 21. Okay, so item 290 stay on track we're trying to get through this as fast as possible is a disney princess royal dress up trunk donated by santa claus <laughs> it has a value of 30 dollars and a top bid of 22 dollars um so this is awesome as much as all kids love disney disney princesses are so amazing um uh, maybe molly molly is a big disney fanatic 
All right. Item number 309 is a Cabbage Patch Collectibles Cuties, donated by Santa, and it has a value of $25 and a current top bid of $22. Less than two minutes left now. Less than two minutes left. For the tech crew part of the auction, we have the lovely Pat O'Neill. Oh, He's going to hang out with us. Yes, it is. And then, and then the, the, the <laughs> second half from 10.30 to 11 will be um, two other captains. The others, the other two are kind of sick right now, so they can't. their voices are kind of out. Oh, no. <laughs> well, it's kind of just everyone hanging out, reading all the auction items. So one minute left. One minute left. All right, so one minute left of the toy auction. All right, uh... Yes. Yes. Uh, what What does Jason have though? Jason has one fifteen. One fifteen. It's a Crayola light up tracing pad. It's ch donated by Charlene Alderful Alderfer. Has a value of forty dollars and a current top bid of twenty five dollars. Ah! Uh, all right, the toy auction is about to end. One more. Is that a toy? Uh, two two ninety three. Uh, yes, uh, it is. Oh. Uh, ah! Rub a dub bathtub toy seat. Donated by Santa, value of twenty dollars, and a current top bid of ten dollars. Let me bid. Wait, did it let you bid? Nine fifty nine. Let's see. That's, it's, it means it's busy. It means their phone's like. We are about to close this toy auction. Hope you've gotten your bids in. Um, apparently, Meredith has not. But okay. All right. Wait. It's 10 oh, it's closed. The toy auction is closed. Oh wait. Thank wait. You. What? Now we're doing the big ticket items. I think is what I heard. Are we all staying? I'll I'll stick around. Okay, Pat, do you want to do one? Yes. Alright. Hello. This is item 144. You got it? Very exciting. Um it is a Keurig K Select single serve K cup pod coffee maker. <laughs> It was donated anonymously and has a value of 130 and a current top bid of $75. Um, I Keurigs, we have one at home. It's a really easy way to make hot chocolate, coffee, all that good stuff. Very, very highly recommend. Highly recommend. Great holiday gift for anyone. Well, not anyone, but adults, teenagers. I don't know. Hey, your call. You could give it to a three-year-old. I guess. <laughs> The buttons light up. There's a nice box. They oh, play excuse in. me. Sorry. <laughs> I didn't mean to do that. Uh, item number four, uh, 141 is a Philips Air Fryer donated by the Egan family. has a value of $200 and a current top bid of $120. You know, those things are like, they th they like, they like uh, fry your things. And it's really cool because it doesn't use a lot of oil and it's very safe. All right. Our next item is uh, item number 476. Oh my god, this is really not working here. I'm sorry, there we go. 476 is a penguin floral arrangement donated by Haas Florist and Maynard. has a value of $40 and a current top bid of $20. It's a beautiful item, um, beautiful arrangement. They do such a great job. Um, and I really think you should bid more on this. Agreed. Agreed. That's all I have to say. Item number 114 is a Women's Tough Mudder Merrill's Trail Running Sneakers, size 8. It was donated anonymously and has a value of $110, and it has a top bid right now of $35. Um, these are really cool sneakers. They have, um, like, it's, it, you don't tie them. You you twist a, what, a twist a knob. Yeah. It's like you running shoes. Yeah. A what? Boa. Gavin says it's called Boa, that you twist it and it tightens the shoe for you. <laughs> they're really nice, and they're black and orange, so if you want to rep the Maynard colors. I'd like to make a quick, crucial update. Um, I called the phones at, like, 9.56, 9.57, and they were busy, and then they finally let me call at 10, and I bid on it, and it was gone. So, yeah. no giraffe That's why me. you guys got to bid early and bid high. I'm busy. And so are the phones. And it looks like all the toys are already being taken away from us. And I hope I hope you have all learned your lesson from this this round, the the toy auction, and can apply it in all the other auctions we have going on here, the floral, the general. Yeah, because because the, the auction's going to end in like an hour. It's going to end in an hour, but you might not be able to get through in time. So, like Pat said, bid early, bid high. All right. 
What's next? Yep. Uh, item number 110. I don't know. Is this is the Tough Mudder Basket. Yes. It's got a value of something that I don't 145 know. and a current top bid of 25. Oh. Oh. Oh, oh, that is worth so much, guys. You can totally bid more on that. We can get that higher. We can get that higher. We, that could definitely get higher, even if it's just a little bit Possible. higher. It's, but it's worth a ton more. All right, Pat, what do we have next? Next up, we have number 197. This is an Amazon Echo Dot speaker with Alexa, donated by the Tomino family, worth $40 and has a current top bid of $40. Um, so these Echo Dots are amazing. I have one on my um, nightstand next to my bed. And every night before I go to bed, I analyze how much homework I have to do in the morning and then tell it to wake me up at a specific time. And how do, do you feel knowing that Alexa is watching you 24-7? I'm fine with it. I, it's okay, you've heard from uh, some of our tech crew. They like being stalked. Cool. Item 300. Gavin, Focus. Item 300 is a dog package donated by Scrub a Dog. Has a value of 50 and a current top bid of 35. Scrub a Dog, great place downtown. Jason, why do you still have that? Nope, sorry. Scrub a Dog's great. <laughs> Continue. <laughs> that makes such a strange noise. It sounds like an old lady laugh. Like, <laughs> like, <laughs> like <laughs> that's what the that's what <laughs> that's what the thing sounds like. All right. Um, uh, item number 296 is another Amazon Echo Dot. It's donated. This one's donated by Santa, though, and it has a value of $40, but only a current top bid of $35. Ooh. You know you know what? How about you bid on both Echo Dots? How about that? For the chance to get one of them. Yeah. Why don't you just get both to get both? And then you could be, like, in two ends of your true, house and be true, like, true. Alexa, and they'll both you be like, link yes, and it'll be double times the scary. <laughs> You have to like look at. I don't know how it works. <laughs> I'm not gonna bother to. Item number one forty one is again this Philips air fryer, donated by the Egan family, has a value of two hundred dollars and a current top bid of one hundred and twenty dollars. Eat healthier without giving up taste with this air fryer by Philips. Using rapid air technology, fry, bake, roast, and grill with just a tablespoon or less of oil. If you're like me and love fried food. But like mm -hmm. you know, you, you feel know you gross shouldn't. after. You're like you, you can't. You just you know inside you can't, but you really want to. That is your solution, and it's a perfect gift for anyone. Item number four twenty four is a numbered print American Porches one by Mary Mark, donated by Roberta Witz, has a value of two hundred and eighty five dollars and a current top bid of only twenty dollars. <laughs> this could go for so much more. Um, this is beautiful artwork. And it's print it number really nice. 15 out of 88, set in gold trimmed frame and mounted in a stylish mat. This artistic work comes from Picture Yourself Gallery and Custom Framing in Chelmsford, Massachusetts. So, next up, we that have stung. number 178, which is a Bose Soundlink micro Bluetooth speaker, colored orange. It's donated by Bose, has a value of $100, and has a current top bid of $70. So, if you're looking for a gift for anyone who likes music or is like a person, who likes music, which is everyone. Basically just a person, it's, yeah. It's a good gift. If you like music. Every, you never realize you need a Bluetooth speaker until you get a Bluetooth speaker. You never know you need things until you get them. <laughs> and this is, a, this is a perfect example of it. Yes, I'm on to video. Jason, what's the number? No, I'm good. 315. Oh. Is a baseball signed by World Series champion Red Sox Joe Kelly. It was donated by the Red Sox, has a value of $110, and has a current top bid of $150. Wow. Woo! Thank you. This is, that's a very good item. Uh, Own a part of baseball deal. history with this baseball signed by World Series champion Red Sox pitcher Joe Kelly. He was an amazing in the postseason, allowing just one earned run in the 11 and a third innings over nine appearances. That's actually insane. All right, so next up is item 476. number 476. Again, the penguin. It's a really cute Floral little thing. Range. Right now, it has a uh, top bid of $20. It's worth $40, and it, obviously it's worth $40. Look at that. It's so cute. It's a little penguin um, in the front there, and it's got some beautiful leaves coming out of it. I think item number 130 is up next. Yeah. It sure is. 
It's an extra large Boston College jacket <laughs> donated by the Mullen family. Has a value of two hundred dollars and a current top bid of only sixty dollars. I know sixty dollars is like a nice price for a jacket, but this is a very nice jacket and is worth much more than that. Is this? Is this the right jacket? Oh, no, could be. Like, hey, Mayor. I was like, who are you? I said, who are you? And they didn't <coughs> oh, they can see the TV. Two thirteen. Oh. Item two thirteen is a Harry Potter. Oh, hello. No, I. Oh, yeah. Thanks. Item two thirteen is a Harry Potter's collector's basket. Oh, this is cool. Um, donated by Oliver, <laughs> Oliver's wands and wizard wizarding wares. Has a value of one sixteen and has a current top bid of sixty five. I would bid on that if I was a Harry Potter fan. I'm not a Harry Potter fan. And we are gonna make Pat you a Harry Potter fan. Never watched the movies or read the books. Yeah. Isn't that sad? That's that's a lie. I read two and a half, maybe three books, and then watched like some of the movies. Some of the movies. Fake fan. Uh, okay. I didn't say I was a fan. <laughs> All right. So um, we're gonna. So me, me and Meredith are gonna kaboom. take the time to convince Pat to like me and Harry Meredith. Potter. Yeah, me and Meredith. And um, we're going to bid on this basket to, to <laughs> make him read all the books. Oh. All right, what's next? Sponsored America uh, um, Runs on Duncan. Next. Um, wait, uh, we have all this. Wait, Mer- <laughs> I want it. <laughs> Merry Christmas. Number 119 is a designer sunglasses by face. Donated by Look Optical. It has a value of $250 and has a current top bid of $100. Um, these are really nice glasses. Um, designer, they're purple and blue. Um, Jason is rocking them. I highly, um, top bid is 100. So it's, it's higher than it was last time I checked. So good job on the, the bidders. Good job. But definitely not even halfway there. Whoa. Um, 116 is the next item. It's a designer sunglasses by face, also donated by Look Optical. Has a value of $250 and has a current top bid of $60. All right, thank you, Trevor. Oh, beautiful. Yes. Oh, yeah. So if you can't tell, it's in shades of pink, brown, yellow, and blue. And they're not only beautiful, but they're also versatile. Oh. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. This is number 474. I think I read that right. Yep. 474. It's a mini tree floral arrangement donated by Haas Florist in Maynard. Has a value of $50 and has a current top bid of uh, $20. Sorry. Um, so it's like, I don't know how to, it's like a pyramid shape. It's like a Christmas tree. It is, yeah. Yeah. It looks like a Christmas tree and it's really cute. I think that would be a great centerpiece for anyone's home. Or, yes, table. Oh, Gavin almost broke it. But we're good. What is this? 477. 477 is a uh, snowman floral arrangement donated by Haas Florist. It has a value of $40 and a current uh, top bid of $10. I think we can definitely get more. Emmeline has something to say? What's your question, Emmeline? All right. Um, so I do remember a Tough Mudder basket going around, and I did see the shoes on the auction yes. list, but I don't see the shirt and pants and maybe basket. Does anyone know what number it is? Have they seen it? Um, <laughs> Any on. memory? No? Hang on. Okay. So there's a, a Tough Mudder basket? No, no the shoes separate. are separate. Okay. 110. Thank you, audience members. <laughs> All the uh, uh, Meredith so, on the no, phone right now bidding. <laughs> number one seventy two is a nautical nautica black aviator sunglasses donated by Mr. Christopher Datavi. Has a value of one hundred twenty dollars and has a current top bid of one hundred and fifty dollars. No way, overbid. A uh, way Thank overbid. Thank you so That's much, awesome. guys, for doing that. Um, these are really stylish, as you can obviously see. Molly Hines is rocking them. Um, and no wonder they're overbid. They're amazing. So if you want to get your hands on these, go ahead and call the number. It's on your screen right now, 2419. All righty. Our next item is item number 481. 481 is a um, f- swan floral arrangement. It's donated by Haas Flores Maynard. It has a value of forty dollars and a current top bid of thirty-five dollars. Woo! Wow. Oh, it's you. It's very okay. pretty. Item. Mayor, is this the one you had wanted? No. 
Okay, never mind. <laughs> but it's cute. Item 169 is a... Do I, is that Nautica? Yes. Yeah, Nautica black and brown patterned sunglasses. Donated by Chris Atavi. Has a value of 120 and a current top bid of 50. Oh, look look at that. That is the definition of um, suave and stylish. Um, beautiful sunglasses. I... You know, if you're going away for Christmas or anything somewhere tropical, I would suggest getting um, sunglasses or just preparing for summer. I might bid on them. Next up is number 213, which is a Harry Potter's collector's basket donated by Oliver's Wands and Wizarding Wares. This has a value of $116 and has a current top bid of $65. So it has, it has the complete seven book set um, commemorating the 20th anniversary of the series. Um, and
11. Doesn't like gifts and who being rustic. Perfect gift, perfect match. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. I'm here all day. Meredith, you're such a mood just laying back, covering your face with the iPad <laughs> as you talk. I look ugly. Number 193 is a Santa votive candle holder, which was donated by the Lally family. has a value of $10 and has a current top bid of $5. So this is a candle holder, um, and it's a Santa sitting down holding a pot. And uh, this cold, this candle holder has been retired, and the holder is five and a half inches long. All right. Our, um, our next item um, is going to be item number 333. It's an American Girl of the Year, Lu Luciana Vega, Mini Doll and Stem Kit. Donated by the Gavin family has a value of forty eight dollars and a current top bid of twenty dollars. Oh, so this so I I haven't been keeping track with American Girl dolls Girl of the Year. So this one uh, is uh, has her heart set on exploring Mars and she loves science. So that's pretty cool. Got to have those uh, representation. Love that. This is number three hundred. Um, and this item is a dog package donated by Scrub a Dog. has a value of $50 and has an overbid of $55. Um, so it comes with a fun dog toy, um, clam chowder dog treats, and a $50 gift card for Scrub a Dog located right on Main Street in Maynard. This is awesome. It's definitely worth more than $50 because it has the dog treat, uh, the dog toy and the treats. So um, great, great gift for dogs or someone who owns a dog. All right, item 330 is a Boston Bruins three-piece onesie set donated by the Egan family. has a value of 20 and a current top bid of 20. Um, there's a lot of excitement going on, so me and Lucas are going to head off and uh, get ready for closing, and we're going to have some members of our lovely tech crew um, come join Pat. All so, right. Thank you. You get an iPad. You get an iPad. I feel like Oprah. <laughs> Here you go. Hello. I have been waiting Hello. for this. My entire life I've just led up to this moment. I don't know yeah. how these iPads so. work. Here you go. Yeah, so you just put in the number. Oh, I see. Uh, oh, very clever. I'm Michael. I'm Nick. Oh. So we're going to be with you for the last half hour here. Oh. Hello. Uh, all right. All right. Uh, oh, yeah. Let's see here. So we're going to do our gift certificates uh, now. Let's see. Oh. Where is. Oh, there we go. Do you want me to reverse order? I can go. Mm -hmm. Yep. Alright. So, is that one higher than this? Okay. So, starting with number 486, Art Specialties, a $25 gift card. Alright. Let's see here. Uh, wait, Meredith, did you? What's up? Why did you why did you put it in the envelope here? No, um. That's just for your email, right? You. So we're doing gift certificates. No, no, you just go to auction, you type it in. We're doing gift certificates. Yeah, but right? they're in the auction. Okay. So if you do 4446, you can do four. here, this one's easier. Just type it in here. Oh. And if it well, goes away, just tap the screen again. There we go. We're learning. We're learning this. All right. So, item four hundred eighty-six is an art specialties uh, twenty-five dollar gift card. Uh, art specialties is a specialty gourmet shop on Nason Street in Maynard. They offer cheese, wine, beer, flavored olive oil, vinaigrette, chocolate, crackers, hot sauces, dry fruit, mixed nuts, dry meat, tea, and more. I've actually been there before, uh, not too long ago. Really cool place. They've got this huge wall full of hot sauces, and if you saw our, our Manly Cooking vs. Dying Diva segment, you know we I've like had, that. I had some interesting experiences with hot sauce recently. Yeah. Uh, it has a value of $25 and current top bid of $30, which is an overbid. Thank you yeah, all for thank that. Thank you. That is. All right, so our next item will be 483. Uh, be the Love Yoga and Wellness 10 Class Pass. So this is... Mm -hmm. So let's see here. All right, so um, it is uh, has a value of one hundred and sixty dollars, and has a current top bid of one hundred forty dollars. So we are almost there, guys. Um, so uh, this is a ticket for uh, ten classes at the B Love 
uh, yoga studio in downtown Maynard. It offers uh, classes for every range of ability, from brand new to a seasoned practitioner. Yeah. My mom and sister have both actually uh, gone there. They told me it's a really great place. I've seen that. I've seen it before. Um, really lovely, brand new sto- uh, studio uh, right in downtown Maynard. My grandmother has actually, uh, ever since the visit uh, with my uh, one of my aunts, has started doing yoga, and she's actually been doing it for the past three years or so. Really? That's really cool. Yeah, it's very cool. All right. Item number 459 is a Explore Pathways to Wellness Certificate for 30-minute massage or three one-hour classes donated by Explore Pathways to Wellness. It has a value of $45 and a current top bid of $25, so we can definitely get that up there. This certificate gives you options for the best way to help you relax, revive, and renew at Explore Pathways to Wellness Healing and Learning Centers in downtown Maynard. Choose from a 30-minute massage or three one-hour classes in core movement integration or meditation and breath work. You know, it's really great for uh, anybody who's feeling a little bit stressed out. A little bit stressed out. Great for yeah. your uh, telephone tech crew members or yeah. hosts. And hosts. General yeah. staff. All sorts of people. It's just... Great for everybody, really. So let's get that bit up. Everybody use a little stress relief. Uh, So we're going to go on to our next item, uh, 457, which is a Studio 42 gift certificate for one one haircut. It is donated by Studio 42, has a current value of 24, and a top bit of $5. And I know you guys can really get that up, $5 for... Something that's valued at twenty-four. My tech is giving me some symbols. I don't really know what they mean, but anyway. So I've actually been meaning to get a haircut. If you guys can't tell, Um, it's it's getting a little bit long. It's kind of impairing my vision. A little bit, a little bit bit too much. Although I do kind of like it long like that. But anyway, um, so I guess maybe maybe I'll bet on this. You know, save some save some money. Yep. All right. This is a big one. Item 453 is a City Sampler Certificate for a th- for three-night hotel stay donated by City Sampler Reser- uh, Reservations. It has a value of $500, and it has a current top bid of $450. Enjoy a three-night stay in the city of your choice at a three- or four-star hotel for up to two adults and two kids. So... uh, Also, please note that there is a blackout date of December 31st, so that makes for a really good uh, trip for you and your family, Uh, and as we said, it's a value of 500, current top bid of 450, so let's get that up. Yeah, recently, actually, over over summer break, me and uh, my mom and my brother actually went to Niagara Falls on a three-day trip, so this is kind of exactly the perfect thing to get for something like that if you want to go there or anywhere nearby. So, um, moving on to the next one, we have the Spring Fling Admission for One Couple, item uh, number 449. So, it is donated to us by the friends of WAVM. It has a current bid, it has a value of $40 and a current top bid of $55, which is actually an overbid, so that's very good for us. Very good, and, very good. Uh, we thank you guys for that. So, um, so this is Secure Your Daughter's Spot for the 15th Annual Spring Fling Father-Daughter Dance. This event is a favorite tradition for Maynard girls in kindergarten through sixth grade and always sells out. Very good. All right, moving on to item 446 is a Maynard Elks Lodge Hall rental donated by the Maynard Elks. It has a value of $500, but a current top bid of $150. Ha- hosting a big party or graduation, the Maynard Elks Lodge has you covered with this certificate for a hall rental. We actually uh, used this about five years ago for my sister's graduation. Uh, we bid on this item. So if any of you have a uh, graduating student coming, uh, who a uh, student graduating soon, you could bid on this I right now. Do you know uh, that? A couple of those. Actually. I do know. I actually went to a graduation party at the Elks Lodge uh, last year, or I guess this most recent, most recent graduating year. Uh, it was uh, pretty good, uh, and. Uh, I know we can get that value up because this is definitely a great space uh, for really anything. Any sort of event, gathering, whatever you want to do. Mm-hmm. So uh, moving on to our next item, item 444 is uh, Manchester Monarchs trade, uh, Man- Manchester Monarchs tickets for, for four and food vouchers. Uh, it was donated to us by Michael Newey, 
that is valued at $100 and has a current top bid of $300. So I know we can get that up, guys, because that is an absolute steal right now. So anyway, um, so enjoy a night of uh, Haku with the Manchester Monarchs on February 9th in the pink in the for Pink in the Rink Night in support of breast cancer awareness. These tickets for four also include $40 worth of food vouchers. The Manchester Monarchs are a pro hockey team affiliated with the LA King. Um, so I'm, uh, I don't get to play a lot of hockey because I don't know how to ice skate, actually. But oh, really? I'm a real big fan of watching hockey. I've been to several Bruins games. I enjoyed mm-hmm. all of them. So if you guys like hockey or sports in general, because uh, hockey is very interesting, I think I would suggest you guys pick this up. It's very cool. Uh-huh. Yeah, I I personally am not a big uh, hockey fan, but I think that sounds really fun. So I would like to, I, I might donate on that. Donate a bit. Donate. You can also right. donate. I could also donate. Item 439 is a is a uh, gift certificate for hairstyles by Jenny B. $50 gift card donated uh, by Jenny Blood. has a value of $50 and has a current top bid of $60, which is an overbid. Which is an overbid. Thank you, guys. Thank you very much, but we can keep going with that one. You know, this is a great value. Trust Jenny B. to help you look and feel your best with a new style. Hairstyles by Jenny is located inside uh, Vivi's Hair Salon in downtown Maynard. So this is something that's also useful to me as uh, I have really curly hair. It's naturally yeah. curly. I don't use hair products. Some people think I do. It does not but it's naturally curly, products. so it makes kind of finding a barber who can actually cut hair like this kind of tricky. Oftentimes, I can't go to barbers who usually cuts guys' hair, so I actually have to go to barbers for, like, girls, the kind of, like hair my salon. mom goes to. Yeah. But yeah, maybe you, should, uh, maybe you should bet on that. Maybe I should. All right. Uh, so our next item, uh, four twenty-eight, is an. I'm not sure how to say that second. One. Empower. Physio. Physio gift certificate for three private Pilates classes. If we messed up, we're sorry. Yeah, uh, it has a value of one hundred fifty dollars with a current top bid of only twenty-five dollars. So we can definitely raise that up because right now that's a steal and a half. Uh, Get in shape and build your strength with these three private Pilates classes from Empower Physio Pilates uh, and Physical Therapy in Maynard. All right. Um, so our next, our next item, item is number 422. It's a Floral Moment $25 gift certificate donated by a Floral uh, Moment. It has a value of $25 and has a current top bid of $50. That which is, is double. That the, is, which is double. double. That's a really which good overview. Fantastic. Thank you guys I so that. much. I love that. It's You could go mm-hmm. even higher with that. I mean, this is great. This is great value. Absolutely. Send flowers to a loved one or yourself with this gift certificate from a floral mo- uh, moment in Chelmsford, Massachusetts. Yeah, flowers are really a great gift for any occasion. Um, my, my grandmother uh, loves to garden. Uh, my brother... Or not, my brother loves to garden with her, so really from all ages, from 70 yeah. to 11, and of anywhere in between. Anybody. And further out, too. Mm-hmm. Everybody loves flowers. So, our next item, 363, is a Maynard Outdoor Store $40 certificate, gift certificate. Um, it is donated by the Maynard Outdoor Store, has a value of $40, and has a current top bid of $40, which is right. exactly That's great. Let's see if we can price. get an overbid can we get on that. get an overbid on that, guys? Yep. Just a couple uh, a couple dollars, and you could get a nice overbid. Uh, so the Maynard Outdoor Store is a, is a Maynard's favorite for, uh, show, uh, for clothes, sports. shoes, sporting goods, and so much more. Yep. Um, back when I played baseball, I used to go there all the time to shop for cleats. Yep. And gloves and balls. That's the same for me when I played soccer. Uh, that's basically where I went to get everything and all the different, uh, all my different, um, the clothes, cleats, as you said, um, balls, anything you, anything I needed. Yep. All right. Item 359 is a China Ruby $30 gift certificate donated by China Ruby, has a value of $30, and has a current top bid of $30. So, exactly like I said before, it's great that we got, uh, met that. Let's see if we can get an overbid on that. Doesn't take uh, only takes a couple of dollars, uh, and yeah, use this certificate for China Ruby in downtown Maynard to satisfy your craving for some sesame chicken or a mai tai when you are done with all your holiday shopping. I've been to China Ruby quite a few times. I love the food there. Yeah, um, we it's it's become a, yeah. a bit of a tradition to go there after the first showing of every play. Yep, uh, Maynard High School plays that yep. is. 
the um, cast and uh, the tech crew for that go there um, every year. It's a great place, and they're always very accommodating. They're always for very us. accommodating, which I know not, can be difficult yeah. for your, a large group of teenagers. Yeah, we're not a very good As group to serve, expect. so we appreciate uh, that. All right, our next item, uh, number three fifty four, is a uh, De Cordova Sculpture Park and Museum passes for two. Uh, it has a current value of fifty six dollars and has a current top bid of seventy five dollars, which is an overbid. Uh, so thank you guys. Uh, you and a friend can spend a day at the Decorva Sculpture Park and Museum, exploring their contemporary art and sculpture inside and outside. You'll discover something new every time you visit their beautiful thirty acre campus in Lincoln, Mass. All right, that sounds uh, really cool. I'd love to go and see that. I've never been before, and I think it would be a great trip to have. All right, for uh, uh, next up, we're also is joined now by oh yeah, we're also joined tech by crew Hannah. member Hannah. Hello, Hannah. Hi, everyone. So, item number three hundred forty-five is a Mayor Rod and Gun Club uh, function hall rental. Uh, it has a value of four hundred twenty-five, but a top bid of two hundred and twenty-five dollars. So we could definitely get that up. Um, yep. It's really that's a really good uh, value right now. So. Planning a big birthday party, graduation, or just a small dinner with a couple hundred of your closest friends? Grab this certificate for a rental of the function hall at the Maynard Rod and Gun Club. Uh, we also, um, I've been to quite a few, um, what was I, I was, Events. graduation parties, that's the word. You can tell I'm about to graduate, I can even remember the word. Uh, mm -hmm. Yeah, it's, it's a great place to go. Um, very nice people. Very nice people, uh, large area. Large, right. large open space. All right. Okay, so so the auction oh, yeah. uh, we're drawing close, uh, drawing near to the end of the auction. to the end of the auction. The auction closes at eleven. Yep. I believe it's uh, around ten forty-five right now. Yeah, so you guys have about yeah, 15, fifteen minutes left. So our next item is item number one forty-four. It is a cure egg. Oh yeah, sure. Here you go, Hannah. Oh, I had t I got two microphones coming at me, so. The Keurig K-Cup Single Serve K-Cup Pod Coffee Maker with Strength Control and Hot Water On Demand Matte Black. I guess that's the name of this. This coffee house. <laughs> okay, in matte black color. Um, will taste great in your home. <laughs> it's tastes great. I, I believe it's the coffee that will taste. Yeah, the great. coffee tastes great. Your home, the matte black color. It has a value great. of one hundred and thirty dollars and a current top bid of eighty five dollars. It also tastes great anywhere else. It doesn't have to be in your home. Uh, that's not a requirement. It could be in your office. It could be wherever you want. It's the perfect cup anytime. And there's a bonus six count K cup pod variety pack when you when you purchase this. What a great deal. So item one ninety eight is a painting entitled Island from Boat by John McAdam. It was donated to us by the Three Stones Gallery. It has a value of $200 and a current top bid of $100. So, um, so this is, uh, this is uh, John McAdams, for those who are not aware, is a, actually a Massachusetts, Massachusettsian? Massachusetts? Native? Massachusetts native artist. <laughs> um, he has many private collections and galleries throughout New England. So uh, it's great to support uh, the Beacon and the Beacon Santa Telethon charity fund, and you know local, local artists. Mm -hmm. um, so, uh, next up is item number one hundred and forty-one. It's the uh, Phillips Air Fryer, donated by the Egan family. It's got a value of two hundred and a current top bill bid of one hundred and twenty dollars. Eat healthier without giving up taste with this air fryer by Phillips, using rapid air technology. Fry, bake roast and grill with just a tablespoon or less of oil uh, like we said this only the current top bid is $120 we could definitely get that up uh, I think Pat said before it's a much healthier option to uh, to uh, deep frying your food and so if you love that taste but don't want to feel sick afterwards there you go this next one's a great item this is item 197 and it's an Amazon Echo Dot speaker with Alexa which is donated by the Tomino family. It has a value of $40 and has a current top bid of $40. We're so close to an overbid. This $1 is a, yeah, $1 away. Yeah. I'd like to say as well, I also support uh, Echo Dots like Pat. I've got one, uh, they're really useful. In the morning, it tells me uh, what the weather is, what my commute's gonna be, 
as well as uh, the uh, as well as gives me a flash briefing of the news and what's going on. Yeah, my grandmother loves her Alexa. We play it at dinner all the time. <laughs> you did not say. <laughs> all right. Uh, n- item number four hundred and twenty-four is a uh, numbered print American uh, porches one by Mary Mark, donated by Roberta Witz. It has a value of two hundred and eighty-five dollars, but a current top bid of twenty dollars. Let's try and get that up. Uh, it's definitely worth it. A beautiful numbered print entitled uh, American Porches One by artist Mary Mark. The print is number 15 out of 88 and is set in a gold trimmed frame and mounted in a stylish mat. This artistic work comes from Picture Yourself Gallery and Custom Framing in Chelmsford, Massachusetts. Really is a beautiful painting, uh, so let's try and get that up. Yeah, that is that is a very nice painting. Um, our next item, item 178, is a Bose Soundlink Micro Bluetooth speaker in the color orange. It has a <laughs> it has a current value of one hundred dollars, and it has a value of one hundred dollars and a current top bid of seventy. So we're pretty close there. Um, so this is waterproof and rugged, as it describes, and is uh, very good. It has a range of thirty feet through wireless and battery life up to six hours. So that sounds pretty good yeah, to me for you really get whatever you can think the of Amazon Echo um, so and uh, pairs them up and so you have more um, speakers just to let everyone know we got 10 minutes left until the auction closes it's 10 Only minutes, 10 so, minutes. so you should really uh, try and get there in in there now because the phones will get uh, jammed jammed up so you don't want and you don't want to lose out like uh, Meredith did earlier on the toy auction yeah. anyways so sad next up is item 114 it's a woman's tough mutter Merrill's Trail running sneakers, size eight, donated anonymously. It has evol- a value of one hundred and ten dollars and a current top bid of thirty-five dollars. So still, uh, you can st- still bring that up just a few dollars to try and get that great deal. These this fast and versatile shoe gr- uh, grips, drains, and protects during the toughest of tough mutter challenges. A uh, really good pair, a good looking pair of sneakers, and yeah. Yeah, our uh, our next item is item number 119, and they are designer sunglasses by Face, donated by Look Optical. They have a value of $250 and has a current top bid of $100. Wow, we can see our elf looking absolutely stunning in those in those glasses. You can enjoy the sun in style with these colorful sunglasses designed by Face at Maynard's own Look Optical. Yes. My actually, uh, my glasses are made by Face, and mine I got them too. from Look Optical. Yeah, mine are and Face, Anna's. like a Face design made by yep. Mr. Uh, Mr. Thayer himself. Mm-hmm. My uh, radio show is sponsored by Look Optical, actually. Oh, really? So yeah, that's pretty cool. Nice. Uh, item number 110 is the Tough Mudder gift basket, donated anonymous, anonymously. It has a value of $145 and a current top bid of $40. Let's try to see if uh, by in these next 10 minutes we can get an overbid on that. Know someone who loves to get dirty? This item is just for them. The basket is filled with official Tough Mudder items. You'll find a Tough Mudder uh, branded hat, headband, shorts, and compression shirt, as well as a notebook, uh, ferociously strong T-Rex tape. Um, it, t- it takes a tribe, written by Tough Mudder founder and CEO Will Dean. Let's get muddy. Let's get muddy. And, you know, when you're getting ready, you might need something to protect your face. And what better than our next item, item 116, designer sunglasses by face, donated oh, to us by look, the Look Optical. Again, it has a current good. value of 250 It has a value of 250 and a current top bid of only $65. I know we can get that up, guys. I would pay that kind of money for these glasses. Those oh, are yeah. some pretty Those nice are glasses. Those are pretty nice-looking sunglasses, yeah. So... Uh, yeah, make sure to get that. Our next item. All right. I guess I'm reading the next item. So, item yep. number 133 is a Disney Villains theme bag donated by Lisa Massey. It has a value of $200 and has a current top bid of 75 Crazy. I think we can definitely get that up. So, who doesn't love the villains? This Little Mermaid's Ursula tote bag is packed with all things good and evil. It has limited edition Lion's King, Scar, Kooky, collectible pen, 
Three Pack Villains Journal, Snow White's Old Hag Ornament, and Sleeping Beauty's Maleficent T-shirt, and yeah. many, many more items. Let's be honest. The, the villains is re really what makes the Disney movies, so if you have anybody who loves Disney, you can get them this uh, bag. Yes, I agree. And our next item is item number 130, and it is an extra-large Boston College jacket donated by the Mullen family. It has a value of $200 and has a current top bid of $70. I think we can really get that up. This looks like a wonderful jacket. Plus, you can get it a lot for less money than at the the Boston College campus store. I know because I've been there, and everything's quite expensive. So this is a great value, uh, a very high quality jacket. It's um, Under Armour Cold Gear full zip up jacket. So I think if it wasn't an extra large, I would definitely be um, placing a bid on that. Uh, just as a quick word of warning, we have about five minutes till the auction closes. About. Uh, so our next item, item 117, is a Mickey Mouse sandwich maker. It was donated to us anonymously, has a value of $80, and a current top bid of only 25 Now, this isn't the kind of thing you guys can just find anywhere for $25. So you guys... You should really take advantage of this. Yeah, uh, this is this, uh, this unique opportunity. You're not going to get offered this every day. Uh, so it so this is perfect for making sub like grilled cheese and it, French toast and it makes a little toasted Mickey Mouse uh, like head on the top of it. It's very All cool. Right. Careful. Item number 213 is a Harry Potter's collector's basket <laughs> donated by Oliver's Wands and Wizarding Wares. It has a value of $116 and a current top bid of $70. Attention all Harry Potter fans. This beautiful basket holds the complete seven books uh, set commem commemorating the 20th anniversary of the series. The covers are designed by best-selling author and award-winning artist Brian Selznick. It contains a chocolate frog, a package of Birdie Bot's Every Flavor of Beans, and a golden snitch bookmark. Uh, this is great, uh, it's a great gift for anybody who loves the series or is brand new to it. Pat? Yeah. Uh... There, I suggest you guys uh, bet on this soon, otherwise Pat might snag that up. Yeah. So. Or someone will snag it for Pat. Or, yeah. Gotta be careful, you gotta be quick on the draw. Uh, yeah, I'll just take the iPad real quick. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. I'm really not good with technology, even though I am on Tech Crew. Tech Crew, by the way. Yeah, computer technology is way different. But anyways, um, item 160 is a digital photo frame with one gigabyte. SD card donated by an anonymous donor, and it has a value of sixty-five dollars. It has a current top bid of thirty-five. We can definitely get thirty more dollars up in there. Just call in on the number on the screen. It easily displays and manages your digital photos with this beautiful frame. You can apply special effects and create slideshows. I believe I have a, a version of this in my house. It's pretty fun. It creates a nice slideshow. Good dinner conversation. Yeah, that, that one I'm definitely interested in. I think I'm going to go for that. All right. I better hurry. Item number 117, uh, again, is the Mickey Mouse Sandwich Maker, donated anonymously, has a value of $80, and a current top bid of 25 uh, Like we said before, it's great for making uh, grilled cheese sandwiches and French toast. Uh, you can celebrate Mickey's 90th birthday this year with this great sandwich maker. Definitely useful for... Uh, that one time we tried to make grilled cheese. Yeah. It sort of only sort of worked. Uh, we're going to wrap worked. it up soon because we've only got two yes. minutes left there on the auction. There is very little time left in So auction. make sure uh, you take down what num uh, what the numbers of the auction items you want and quickly uh, get get uh, calling those phones. Just yeah, but you we, you know, we do want to keep telling people stuff down to the last minute, Nick, because yeah. we want to keep this going as long as possible. So our next item is uh, item 178, which is... Which is a uh, Nick Red, if you want to no, talk about oh, that. Sorry. Item 178 is a Bose SoundLink micro Bluetooth speaker in orange, donated by Bose. Current value of of $100. Current top bid of $71. We're so close to an overbid on that. So let's qu uh, so let's try and get that up. This is going to be our last uh, auction item th uh, that we're going to show. This waterproof and rugged speaker has durable silicone strap and produces crisp and balanced sound. Uh, like I said before, you can link that with an Amazon Echo Dot you get from uh, this just yep. to uh, help get um, better spread on your audio. 
Alrighty, that was our last auction for uh, this, I guess this telephone, this that telephone is. This this year, for us. Yeah. So for us, yeah, the last telephone for us, which is kind of weird to think Crazy. about. But anyway, um, so yeah, I hope you guys have enjoyed the auctions. I hope you guys got what you want. And we are going to be sending it over to the radio. So.